Well, this pineapple plant is doing really good. It's got a lot of life to it. And you can see the celery plant up here. It's gotten pretty good size. It's pretty thick. Pretty healthy so far. I got to get some water into the pan because the pan's kind of dried out again. With this sun coming out, it doesn't take long to lick up that water. Uh, these are apple trees, and uh, they're one year old from the seed. And yeah, I still have not uh, thinned out my um, aloe vera. It's going crazy. Got to get that done. Those celery plants seem to be doing pretty good. And it's always a little iffy on the pineapple. And then I started, uh, I took a flowering a stalk. It was a uh, live cut and seeing if I can uh, get it started, but who knows. Anyhow, you win some, and you lose some. Well, it's Tuesday, and it is pretty cloudy today. It's supposed to get up to 61. I'm assuming that the clouds will roll on out of here, and uh, if it's going to get to 61, we're going to have to have some sunshine. You can see that the sun is kind of burning a hole in the... Uh, in the clouds out there and if that continues we're going to have a really nice day right now there's almost no wind so I'm going to run over there quick and get my propane bottle and start burning got to turn on my water hose make sure that everything's good I usually use a water hose here because I have my big pile of brush and then my neighbor's property there is uh, no one living there so the weeds are just totally totally gone crazy over there and you know sparks could start that on fire and I don't want to do that of course so let's get started Ooh, it's nice out here Every time I build a fire, I remember a story that was told me when I was a young teenager. It said, uh, white man builds a big fire, stays way back. Indian makes small fire, 
stays close. Well, I don't know if that's a little bit of wisdom that you needed today, but I've always counted it uh, quite interesting. Now my wife made a little special dish for me that, so I could get some energy. This is a blueberry concoction that she just put together for me. Now what's really neat about it is these blueberries, they're out of my garden. So it's a blessing to eat from your own garden. She's running. Doing a pretty good job. 